Today's Hoda Kopp reacts to the Saturday Night Live skit that mocked her this past week. Within the sketch that aired for Halloween, they called out appropriate costumes this year. Saturday Night Live strikes again. On Monday's show, a day before Halloween, Carson Daly talks about celebrities and their costumes. Then he brings up SNL saying, If you're still in need of a last-minute idea for tomorrow, SNL gave a great suggestion on Saturday's sketch, poking fun at SAG AFTRA-approved costumes. Within the skit, Sarah Sherman dresses up as Fran Drescher, the president of SAG AFTRA. Then she approves or denies trick-or-treater costumes for this year, directly calling kids out that have costumes like Barbie, Spider-Man, and Black Panther, saying they are a bunch of adorable scabs, approving generic costumes, Harry Potter as described only in the books, and minor characters from the Bible who have not appeared in any movie or TV adaptations. Likewise, Hoda Kopp lands in the approving category. SNL's depiction of today's Hoda Kopp. As many know, SAG AFTRA is still currently on strike. This decision has effects on which costumes union members can wear. Continuing in the skit, Sarah says, Unfortunately this year, you can't be Yoda, but you can be Hoda. Then a young girl appears with a wig and a business suit on to depict Hoda Kopp from the Today Show. Notably, she carries a wine glass in her hand. She says, The wig is fake, but the wine is real. Letting people know that daytime TV and reality TV are approvable categories. Hoda Kopp reacts to the skit on air. While showing the clip on today, Hoda Kopp appears in the corner of the screen, showing her reaction to the skit. She laughs in response. Then Carson Deli asks, Did you see that? Al Roker is heard cracking up behind them. Acknowledgingly, Hoda closes her eyes and nods to the question. Admittedly, she confirms, I did. I got a couple of texts on that one. Then noting, yeah, that was Kathy Lee Gifford, inspired. Pointedly deferring the use of wine to her old co-host, Kathy Gifford, who used to drink wine on air frequently. Carson says, it's practical, turning to Hoda. It's funny, but it's a really good idea. All the hosts were agreeable to the notion. What did you think about the Saturday Night Live skit? Were you surprised by Hoda Cobb's response? What are your thoughts on the ongoing SAG-AFTRA strike? Give us your thoughts in the comment sections below.